Today's story is Bone Soup. Oh boy! Welcome back. I have another Halloween story for you. It's that time of year. Are you excited? Today's is called Bone Soup. Oh boy. Hmm. That sounds like a tricky one to make. Let's read and see if they manage to figure it out. Spooky! Let's go. I hope you enjoyed the read. One Halloween morning, three very hungry witches were looking for a tasty treat. They checked the cupboards only to find nothing there. Bear, said Nagy Witch. Empty, said Craggy Witch. Only a small dry bone, said Scraggy Witch. Only a bone. Only a bone, you say. Piff, poof. Let's make bone soup, sisters, cackled Nagy Witch gleefully. Bone soup is the perfect Halloween treat. The three witches carried their cauldron and bone far and away until they came to a door. The witches hadn't even begun to knock when the door groaned open and there, the scariest looking monster they had ever seen towered before them. It made the witches shiver, but alas, they were very hungry. Trick or treat, trick or treat, we've something unusually good to eat. It's bone soup. Soup from a bone, said Nagy Witch. Bone soup, impossible. Go away, there will be time for your tricks later, boomed the monster. Piff poof, it's no trick. A bit of water is all we need, promised Nagy Witch. I'm hungry, Papa, said a little monster as she appeared at the door. Can we make bone soup, please? None of your tricks, boomed the monster. Piff, poof, only a treat, Nagy Witch replied. And in minutes, the bone and the water were bubbling inside the cauldron. Nagy Witch gave the cauldron a stir. She took a small taste. Bewitching, she said. If only we had something savory. That's all it needs, but where can we find it? Look, another door, said Craggy Witch. The three witches hadn't even begun to knock when the door opened with a hiss, and there the spookiest ghost they had ever seen floated before them. It made the witches tremble, but alas, they were very hungry. Trick or treat! Trick or treat, we've something unusually good to eat. It's bone soup, soup from the bone. A savory morsel is all it needs. Bone soup, impossible, go away. There will be time for your tricks later, called the ghost. Piff, poof, it's no trick. It's a treat, said Scraggy Witch. And as the ghost was feeling a bit hungry, a most savory eye of a giant was soon bubbling in the cauldron. But dazzling, said Nagy Witch, after a small taste, if only we had something crunchy. And with that, the eeriest of gowls brought forth a long, crackly lizard's tail. Piff, poof, into the cauldron it goes, cried Nagy Witch. Unusual scent began to waft through the air now. Doors creaked open. Windows squeaked wide too. Be gilded, said Nagy Witch. But I wonder, can a tasty tidbit or two be found? Juice of a toad, earthworms, dried dragon wings, drooled a bat. Colored flies, hot and sweet, snarled a goblin. Sludge, slimy sludge, whispered a mummy. Claws, claws, and more claws, rattled a skeleton. Piff, poof, hypnotizing, murmured Nagy Witch. Mixing and stirring, mixing and stirring. Wrinkled fingers, old toenails, howled a werewolf. Dead leaves, cobwebs, and the wrinkliest of prunes, snickered a vampire. Even Nagy Witch had to gasp. Now the crowd was growing hungrier and hungrier and hungrier. Bone soup, soup from the bone, 
This better not be a trick, growled the monster. He was feeling particularly fierce and quite hungry just then. I'll take back that eye, warned the ghost. And the crackly tail, grumbled the ghoul. I won't hang around much longer, sneered the bat. I'll use powers of my own, scowled the goblin. Let's wrap this up now, mumbled the mummy. Don't rattle me further, clattered the skeleton. Ooh, let's go, howled the werewolf. Before it's too late, snarled the vampire, baring his fangs. Bone soup, soup from a bone, they whispered. Bone soup, soup from the bone, they chanted. Bone soup, soup from a bone, they roared. Wait, I know what it needs, called a small voice. You do, asked Naggy Witch. Three taps of your wand, Scraggy Witch, said the little monster. Tap, tap, tap. Two spins of your broom, Craggy Witch. Whirl, whirl. And one wave of your cape, Naggy Witch, if you please. Whoosh! Naggy Witch waved her cape over the bubbling brew. Then she mixed and she stirred and she took one more taste. Slurp! Piff! Poof! Imagine that! Naggy Witch cackled gleefully. Bone soup and it's ready at last! Trick or treat! Trick or treat! called Naggy Witch. We've something unusually good to eat! As a full moon rose in the sky, the three witches filled a steaming bowl of bone soup for all. It was made with ingredients tried and true, and some monsterishly new. The soup was scary, spooky, eerie, bewitching, bedazzling, beguiling, hypnotizing, and spellbinding. But most of all, piff poof, it was bone-chillingly delicious. The end.